Hello everyone. Today I am going to tell the solution of 8th problem from exercise 13.2 from surface areas and volumes from NCRT class 9. In a hot water heating system, there is a cylindrical pipe of length 28 meters and diameter 5 centimeters. Find the total radiating surface in the system. So this is the hot water heating system. In this, this is the cylindrical pipe. So here the dimensions of the cylindrical pipe are given. So those are length of cylindrical pipe L is equal to 28 meters. So this is a cylindrical pipe and uh, so the length is given. This is the total length. So here this is a length 28 meters. So this is H and diameter D is equal to 5 centimeters. Here the measurements are in meters and centimeters. So you have to convert uh, this centimeters into meters. So radius R is equal to 5 by 2 diameter by 2 that is equal to 2.5 centimeters so 1 centimeter is equal to 1 by 100 100 meters so 2.5 by 100 is equal to 0 0.025 meters so this is the radius of the cylindrical pipe and this is the height or length of the cylindrical pipe see here this is the radius and this is the length and here we have to find total radiating surface so this is the curved surface area or this is the curved surface area of this pipe that is 2 pi r h because this is in the form of cylindrical shape so we know the formula 2 pi r h so 2 into pi value is 22 by 7 into r is 0 0.025 into h, h r l is equal to 28 now 7 ones are 7 fours are 28 now 2 into 22 is 44 and 4 into 0 0.025 is 0 0.1 now multiply for 44 into 0 0.1 that is 4.4 meter square. So this is the value of total radiating surface.